Did you know that exposure to loud noise can damage your hearing permanently? Hello everyone, I am Niripama working as an assistant professor in audiology at All India Institute of Speech and Hearing. Today, I am here to talk about a topic that affects millions of people around the world, noise-induced hearing loss. In this video, I will brief on what is noise-induced hearing loss, how it happens, and most importantly, how we can protect our hearing from noise effect. Noise-induced hearing loss occurs when our ears are exposed to loud noises. We are constantly surrounded by potential sources of damaging noises such as traffic noise, machinery sounds, constructional noise, music concerts, or using headphones at high volumes. The impact of noise on hearing will be dependent on level of noise and duration of noise exposure. That is, higher the level of noise and longer the duration of noise exposure leads to greater hearing damage. Let us understand the cause of noise-induced hearing loss. If we divide our ears into three parts, outer, middle and the inner ear, the inner ear houses delicate tiny sensory hair cells which responds to sound. The louder noise exposure can damage these delicate hair cells leading to hearing loss which is permanent in nature. Onset of noise induced hearing loss could be gradual that is over a period of continuous noise exposure person may experience hearing loss or it could be sudden from a single loud event. For example, a normal hearing person exposed to gunshot or burst of crackers, soon after that event, he exhibits symptoms of hearing loss. Early warning signs and symptoms of noise-induced hearing loss are Difficulty understanding speech from distance Difficulty understanding conversations in noisy environments Difficulty to follow phone conversations, keeping the TV volume very high than moderate, ringing, buzzing sensation in the ears, intolerance to very loud sounds. Other health related signs and symptoms could be frequent mood changes, easily get irritability, fatigue and digestive related issues. Some preventive measures are as follows. Usage of ear protective devices such as earplugs or ear muffs in noisy situation offer comfort and better protection. While using headphones, follow 60 to 60 rule. Keep the volume maximum of 60% and listen for only 60 minutes at a time. Regular breaks. Taking breaks from exposure to noise will allow ears to recover. To avoid consequences of noise exposure in occupational settings, certain industries will have an audiologist to implement hearing conservation programs. The main objective of this program is to conduct regular hearing checkups, to monitor sound level measurements in occupational environment, to ensure if workers are using air protective devices with appropriate manner during working duration, to educate employees about the noise effect on hearing and importance of ear protection. Regular hearing checkups by an audiologist are important especially if you're frequently exposed to loud sounds. Early detection can prevent further damage. Hearing evaluation and diagnosis. Audiologist will conduct routine audiological tests to evaluate severity of hearing loss. Further, these test results will be correlated with any history of loud noise exposure for appropriate diagnosis of noise-induced hearing loss, rehabilitation or treatment. Audiologists will recommend protective strategies and hearing aids based on severity of hearing loss. To conclude, noise-induced hearing loss is a permanent condition, but by implementing certain proactive measures, 
we can protect our ears. Remember, our ears are precious and deserve safety. Let us prioritize our hearing health. If you ever have concerns about your hearing, you can reach out to nearest audiologist or visit our institute and get the best service by professionals. Thank you and take care of your ears.